In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. The Transfiguration. The Transfiguration is the Gospel for the second Sunday of Lent. It also happens to be one of the luminous mysteries. The fourth luminous mystery. And John Paul II says that this is the luminous mystery par excellence. Mystery of light. Many lessons. Let's glean this lesson. That Jesus is walking and he's talking and he's climbing with three of his apostles. And these apostles were Peter, James, and John. An essential message of this is that Jesus became man. He became like all of us, except one thing, sin. He wanted to share his life with us. And I would be bold enough to say that Jesus wanted and still wants to enter into a profound friendship with every one of you. Peter, James, and John were his best friends. He wants you to be his best friend. How can that be done? I suggest three ways. First of all, try to avoid hurting your friend at all costs. That means try to avoid committing sin, especially mortal sin. Because mortal, mortal sin severs, truncates our friendship with God. If you've done that, make a good confession. Second is spend time talking with Jesus, your best friend. That's another name for prayer. Prayer is dialogue in friendship with Christ. Last but not least, invite Jesus, your best friend, into your, your interior home, into your heart, into your soul. This is done by participating fully, actively, consciously in the holy sacrifice of the Mass, but also by receiving your best friend into the depths of your soul in Holy Communion. By carrying out those three activities, rejecting sin, growing deep in prayer, and by receiving Holy Communion, Jesus will be your best friend in time and for all eternity. Amen.